Hey guys, we are back with another exciting episode of Earthbound and no more moles. Not right now. Nope, anyway. not one. And we're all dead. This is who's our fifty? All right. In our last episode, we demolished the Mondo Mole after eight tries. Yes, after eight tries. Now we're gonna listen to the Runaway Five and get some relaxation in this game for once. No more epic failures. I hope. Poochie Fud. What kind of name is Poochie Fud? Poochie Fud. I thought we were saying the River Five. Oh well, yeah, look at there. I just got to the manager. River Five owe me a lot of money. They still, they'll stay here until they pay me back. They might be here for a hundred years unless you decide to pay off their debt. <laughs> I am paying crap. I am no paying one. no one off. Let's let Ness do it. Okay, Paula. Show her. Show her you're good. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, maybe it's an S. That makes sense. Uh, I don't want to see Ness's goods. Mm, me neither. Maybe she does so. I still don't want to see it. Me neither. That's a. Close your eyes, people. Hurry, hurry. Okay. All right, you can open them back. <laughs> I don't want to talk to anybody in here. Looks like a strip club. It's not a strip club. Looks like oh, someone got shot. No, it's just a door knocking. I'm changing my clothes. I don't come in. Let's talk to this girl here. Maybe she has something to say. Okay, the runway five. Tell me I can go back to the I have a pass. I'm sure security will stop me. Hey, really? You have a you have a pass? I can't believe it. Can take me with you, please, please, please. Yes. Post is your sister. Yes, this rocks. Let's go. I already have a sister. One's enough. Ooh, my heart is pounding. Of course, she can get in while they're changing. Ew. She likes older guys. Shabadi wap dilly dee da. Shabadi do ba be boop. Alright, let's go. I got those debt blues. If I had $10,000, I could pay off my debts move on to the next time. I wonder if our bus still runs. Maybe rest it out. Ten thousand dollars. Well, yeah, in the old days there were lots of dancers and acts at the series. Except now we're the only at the point here. We even got into debt here, so we're pretty near stuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What kind of sound effect is that? I, don't know, it's, I think it's supposed to. Be. Could be. Anyway, the folks at Tucson will enjoy the Runaway Five show for quite a few years. Looks like to me. Let's talk to everyone in here. I wrote the lyrics to most of the Runaway Five songs. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hot. Money, that's what I want. Money. It's what we ain't got said freedom, freedom, freedom is what we really thought. That's a dumb song. Yes. Hey, yeah, get to see our show, you lucky kid. I hope you pay attention. I don't want to pay attention. I want some bread. I need the coinage. I want more dough all the time. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how to respond to that. Kick him in the nuts. It's the best way to do it. And here we go. The Runaway Five performance. Yeah, that's right. Tonight you get the Chaos Eater Soulman coming at you. Rock and rolling live on this here stage for a limited time only. The world's greatest blues man, the Runaway Five. And here they come. Oh, yeah, Ooh. baby. Ooh. Wondering why there's a sixth member? It's just a default keyboardist of the place we we're playing at. Oh, that was one of the Runaway Five shows. I'm sure we'll be able to see more. Hint, hint. Do they do birthday Mr. parties? Mr. T. Does he do birthday parties? A young fan like you really gets into Runaway Five's music. Wow, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I think it's fool. Why are you in my way? Get out of my way. Oh, pardon me. Hey, you grabbed on the boat. There is no excuse for you. Damn, doom, damn. How come you can still hear the music playing? No. Is 
that guy ever stop complaining about the stupid money? Mm, not until you pay him back. Wow. How many times do we watch him? I don't want to watch him again. I think you're supposed to talk to the Runaway 5. Well, go find the Runaway 5. I can't remember. I don't want to watch it again, though. Go find him. Probably in their dressing room. Oh, I'll well, forget it. We need to talk to him, though. I think I know where I'm supposed to go anyway. I think you don't. I think, I think you're I crazy. Do. I'm not the woos, you know? Yes, you are. Move out of my way, you stupid guy. I kill you! Not Arizona. Because yes. for some reason they can't put it in Arizona. I think that a town like that would be flattered. So? No, I think they'd be flattered by it. I don't care. Actually, I don't know if they would be. It'd be interesting. Yeah. Because Tucson's a bunch of old people. Unless any of you live in Tucson, then it's full of great people. It's true. Blue! Wait, what? Fighting the blue men group. No, no, the enemies in town have blue faces. Or different colored faces. But you guys have seen this. I'm gonna be right back. We are back. Blue men group could not hold up to the runaway five. A toothbrush. What are you gonna use a toothbrush for? What the hell am I gonna use a toothbrush for? Get out of here. Does Paula have stinky breath or something? No. No. Maybe she needs it for you know what. Okay, that's it. <laughs> there. Could have sold it. Damn it. I could have. I thought you knew this, but. Oh well. Ooh, a present! Toothbrush. A skip sandwich. Goody. That would have been helpful earlier. Uh oh, Blue Man Group's back for more. Cranky lady. I don't think we've saw, seen her before. Cranky lady. We won! This music makes me feel like dancing. Wow, I mean, that, that's some up. Alright, here we go. This is now level 23. I've run up by two. I've run up by two. My summary stream went by two. My tweet went up by one. Great level up stats. I can't remember if I'm supposed to go here yet or not. Well, we're about to find out. Yeah. Hi, a sheep. Hi. Oh, oh. Is that a sheep? No, it's a ghost. Looks more like no, a sheep. No, we can't go through here yet. I forgot, you gotta talk to the runaway five. You're gonna let a little ghost stop you? Yeah. I'll be right back. Hey guys, we are back. Only to remember that um, we're supposed to see Everjed once we get Paula, so let's talk to him. Okay, so we have to take her to our parents' floor, and then we come back. So, see you back at the Polestar Preschool. Alright, we're back inside the preschool. It took a while. Talk to, yeah. Not that long, but... Let's talk to her mother first. Yahoo! I knew it, you say, Paula. I don't really understand it, but I know that Paula's miraculous power and your great courage will allow you to stand to any challenge. Paula, if you must take a trip, be sure to take bring us along. The very own handmade band-aid. Ooh, that rhymes! I know, I'll call it a hand-aid. Oh, they're hilarious. Yeah. Oh, Paula got the hand aid. Did you meet? Did you meet Dad? Not yet. Um, these are uh, okay. You guys can read that. Unless you're blind, but. <laughs> you're blind oh, Paula! Ness, thank you so much. You must be the boy who will save the world. Like Paula's dream. Paula, I'm sure you'd be a big help to Ness. It's not every day a father lets his daughter embark on a journey to save the world. Dad, don't worry about me. Ness and I will be able to take care of ourselves. In three, the next town will meet another friend. If the three of us can combine our power, no one can beat us. Now wipe your eyes, blow your nose, and smile before we take off. Goodbye, Paula. Don't worry, I won't cry anymore. Blow it up. Why is he Sissy. following me? He's, fo he's following me. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna do it, Ness. He's gonna take out Ness. No! Alright, now we can go back to Ember Dread. Be right back. Okay, this guy just popped out of nowhere. Hello, Ness. Everjet is looking for you. He's got something for you. Okay, he just told us that. So we'll see you back in Everjet's. We are back. 
Every dread's a punk. Oh, I don't think so. I think so. He's going to ask to be my partner. I don't know if you. I know you'll refuse. It's written all over your face. If you accept it, I was going to give you some money. Actually, I can't keep the money now anyway. Let me give this to you. It's ten thousand dollars. What a quid ink ink. That's the same amount as the put away fiver in debt. Yes. Mm. You cannot refuse my generosity. Just accept it. I plan on looking for an evil many many statue that will ex aggregate unearthed in one net. I'll see you at another time in another space. Paul got the wad of bills. Alright, see you back at the Runaway 5. Or not the Runaway 5, but uh, Poochie Fud. Be right back. We are back. I have very limited time, so I'm just gonna hurry some. Owe me a lot of money, let's stay here and let's pay back. Maybe a hundred. Very hard that speech. Let's see if we run away with the money. Let's show him the wad of bills. The apes! You surprised me. Now I'm not sure what to do. I got the money. Of course, you know the Runaway 5 are uh, free to leave. I got no comments now I have my money. <laughs> Uh -oh. You know what? I'm gonna cut this right here. <laughs> Leave you guys in suspense is what's gonna happen. So, if you like the video, subscribe to the video button up in the corner. Give me five star reviews. I'm gonna this video. I'll be right back for the next episode of Earthbound. See